Hello, this is Mugetsu, and here we are with the Friday stream. I know it was gonna be Donkey Kong Country, but honestly, well, you can see that it's already kind of late. And I was already, I mean, I was caught up in many errands that I had to do, and I would be lying if I say that I'm not tired. <laughs> so I'm not quite in good condition to do that. So instead, you know, <laughs> I'm going for something easier and less stressful and that is you know Mega Man X which is probably one of the best Mega Man games of all time and I think that probably the best Mega Man X game I mean the best game in the entire Mega Man X saga which I think it's both awesome you know that the first one set the bar so high and it's sad that no other game lived up to it all right uh, let me do the usual get the stream on my phone, share the link. Let me share the link, <laughs> that's what I'm missing right now. <laughs> the three cursed letters I know you know to me the fact that Eos means dawn in Greek that will always be the first thing that comes to mind also let me see okay the, the microphone is still working <laughs> all right Well, I guess that's a matter of your point of view. Okay, I can see the control is being fuzzy. Okay, there we go. Ah, <laughs> freaky controller! It's losing signal. Okay. Alright, and now we have, you know, <laughs> shiny new. Opera GX that I installed as promised and we're gonna be, be playing on it I have the pretty much the same tabs that I had opened on Firefox so this shouldn't really be an issue you know I think that it's both a, a curse and a blessing because on the one hand when EOS comes we're gonna lose the last, you know, official Mega Man X game with online. Blessed because we're gonna free up the suffering of Nebula Joy and all fears bullshit. But yeah, it's a um, I've won, but at what cost situation? It's pretty smooth and fast I'm surprised I mean for uh, my daily browsing it works perfectly and I was worried that we get issues with YouTube you know with the thing on ad blockers and stuff but uh, nothing nothing has happened so far so it's a perfect experience <laughs> a perfect browsing experience and it feels even faster and less clunky than Firefox the only thing that I'm missing is that Opera doesn't have integration with FDM, you know, the free download manager. That is the only thing, but it's an acceptable loss. <laughs> the freedom is worth it. X would rather us be free from misery. You know what? You're right. X always hope for a better future. You know, with all the happy memories that X has given us, you know, the people in the fandom, 
And seeing the bullshit that X Dive has become, yeah, I agree. He wouldn't stand for this. <laughs> All right, let's go. Probably the most enjoyable game in the entire Rick saga. Okay, hold on. Let me see if I can improve the performance a little bit by closing other programs. I mean, it's better, but I was having already some hiccups. Also, let me see here. Damn, it's using all my CPU power. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill this. Uh, all right, hold on for a moment. Okay, just hold on for a second. I'm gonna kill the, the tabs. Okay, it's literally down to one tab, so we shouldn't have any more issues. Hello, Pete, welcome. <laughs> Okay, we're back in action. <laughs> you know, I guess that the rest of the hiccups are just because my PC is old. And well, that can't be helped. My PC is like from a decade ago, it's like from 2014. <laughs> it's already amazing that it can hold up this well. <laughs> There is also a DOS Mega Man X version 2, huh? I knew that there was like DOS Mega Man games that had nothing to do with the actual Mega Man games. But... DOS Mega Man X 2? Hola Kevin! Eh... Bueno... Podrías disfrutarlo mientras dure. <laughs> Eso es lo que yo hago.
I mean, I know that the games weren't... I think they are like their own thing. I mean, they were made like in a semi-official capacity, but... I don't think that they are even in the canon. <laughs> Also, wasn't it the, the man that made the Mega Man those games like an independent guy or something? Okay. Okay, I'm not sure if I should go like the same way I did before or if I try to to shake it up and do it a little more differently. Okay, I know that usually you know your go-to is chill pink but, but I don't know, do you guys want me to go for another first maverick? <laughs> He was an employee working at Capcom USA and he made the first game for fun by himself and then someone else from Capcom thought it was a real project and then made it for sale. Okay. Alright, let's go for Penguin. You know, if global warming is not gonna get him, we will. Okay, Penguin, Mammoth, Eagle... Alright, I could do the, the Ruby Spears playthrough. Alright. I wonder why do you not rush the armor or why do you leave chameleon for last? The body armor is nice. No, but the bosses, I appreciate having the extra wiggle room with the bosses.
Well, let's see how your playthrough works with my playing style. <laughs> that I seldom use Maverick weaknesses, I am used to killing them with the Buster. <laughs> That iframe spam, I swear. Hello, TC Korea. Eh, don't worry. We just took down the penguin. I guess it's a feel like Batman moment. <laughs> Alright, let's see. <laughs> yes, Pin, exactly. Freaking Penguin is spamming through Showtime. Report. <laughs> Report to Zero X. Alright. Okay, let's see. So it's. You know what? Let me pin the comment. Penguin, Mammoth. Okay, let's go. You know, this mammoth is not sleepy. <laughs> you know, as a kid, it always bugged me that he's a mammoth and he has no tusks. Okay, things are going well so far. <laughs> Thank you. 
Maverick Hunter X makes me think he's actually... He actually sleeps on the job. <laughs> yeah, he has not the voice I was expecting. It kind of fits. It's just that, you know, in the original Mega Man X, Flame Mambo didn't struck me as dumb muscle or being a brute. Welcome, Five Hyper. He's the slow, easy, and predictable boss. Why wouldn't he be the dumb one? You know, that probably has to do with the fact that, you know, my kid perception is, you know, mammoths are relatives of elephants. Elephants are smart. Yeah, that was probably, you know, my, my childish logic. Mammoths should be smart because they are relatives of the elephants yeah pretty much you know him being heavy and slow didn't necessarily equate with being dumb at least in my childish mind i mean i was like five years old when i played this for the first time Okay, let's see. It's Penguin, Mammoth, Eagle, okay? America! <laughs> but he's a robot mammoth. Hmm. Okay, fair point. <laughs> also, hello, Gana Hater. I mean, elephants are intelligent. That they like peanuts, you know. I mean, can we really judge them? We humans are supposed to be the most intelligent species on the planet. And we like things like alcohol. So, are we really that much better? I mean, elephants have to be big. Who are we to judge elephant beauty standards anyway? <laughs> you know, a skinny elephant probably would look either pathetic or scary. I don't think that there is a middle ground. Okay.
Secretly elephants and mammoths that send dialysis every month. Damn. That would be hella expensive. Could you imagine if an elephant had a long neck? A long neck with a shark's mouth? Okay, we're we're getting out of, you know, biology territory and we're just entering Lovecraftian horrors. I mean, if we wanted a big animal with a long neck, we have giraffes. Well, we don't have sauropods anymore. <laughs> the elephant is used with a kangaroo? What? <laughs> you know what? Best not to know. with fire <laughs> hence gets a flaming buffer The Disney cartoon The Wassels? Nope, I have no idea about that. At least not with that name. I don't know if they translated it into Latin American Spanish. spam is annoying okay I will probably die Where Storm Eagle is tougher, definitely. <laughs> I just have to imagine that it's freaking next Diego in Mega Man XOD. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, that's more like it. That'd be cool to have a big pelican head, but a human's body, a pelican head wearing a big brim hat and a suit like a mafia gangster, big pelican smoking a cigar. <laughs> You know, you reminded me, Uganda, of some memes about El Licenciado Aguilar. <laughs> and they have, you know, a, a guy in a suit with an eagle head. Because Aguilar means basically eagle. <laughs> okay, let's see. Penguin, mammoth, eagle. Okay, now backtrack to get the heart and the master upgrades. Okay. Now that I think about it, we haven't fought in this map in Mega Man XOD in a long time. <laughs> Okay, now let's get the Buster upgrade. Okay, I'm getting, I'm having trouble doing the jump at the last part. <laughs> I'm gonna have a slight lag. Ah, damn it. I think I can just die and retry. Uh, let's see.
Okay, because I did mess up, goddammit. <laughs> Okay, the, the slight lag is indeed throwing me off, goddammit. I was able to do it on Firefox? Uh, okay, I have to die again. Or you know what, I'm wasting lives, I can just exit and re-enter, yeah. Not even worth to die for this. Okay, I can't believe I'm messing up something so basic. Okay, finally! <laughs> Okay, let's see. Penguin, Mammoth, Eagle, Backtrack, Boomer, Kuwanger. Okay? The original Okay Boomer. You know, I still remember the entire debate I had in elementary school with my friends over what the hell was Kuwanger supposed to be and how we reached the general consensus that he had to be some kind of ant <laughs> because nothing else made sense By the way, the music is an absolute banger. <laughs>
Okay, let's see how the hell does the trick work here. I think I have to push myself with the uh, with the eye uh, with the penguin thing, but I'm not sure how exactly. I mean, am I supposed to like go through the wall? I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. No, the, the, I messed up. <laughs> I don't know how to do the trick here. Okay, I don't know how to do the trick to get the heart. And obviously I can look it up. <laughs> Okay, it took too long to figure and I don't even know if that would have worked Okay, I think that is actually the plan. Gonna see if that works. Pushing myself through the wall with the shotgun eyes. Nope. Or do I have to do it like the opposite way? I don't know if I can move fast enough. Nope, not working either. <laughs> How the hell do you do this? I don't see it pushing it, pushing me in any capacity. Yeah, this is not really working. It's not pushing me through the wall.
Yeah, no, it's not working at all. I'm gonna have to do it the way the game intended. Okay, time to do what almost every millennial wishes, defeat the boomer. <laughs> Freaking teleport spam, this is worse than Brotherman EXE Or Doctor Fight <laughs> All right, <laughs> and the boomer went down. You know, compared to the classic Mega Man games, I feel like I shine more here. <laughs> I am really not that bad. I have played games countless times after all. Okay, let's see what's next. Boomer. Mandrill? Shouldn't I backtrack? Ah, you know what, I'm backtracking. Yeah, I mean, the playthrough doesn't mention any more backtracking, so you know what, I'm gonna assume. Any boss I already defeated, I have to backtrack. So, okay.
Yeah, laziness doesn't pay off in this game. I have to destroy this. Or it will let me climb. Having sink a million would be so nice here. Okay, we have the heart. Now we can move on to Cyber Rafiki. <laughs> I haven't seen anything in, in the chat in, the, in a while. Let me check my stream laps up because messages are not showing. Yeah, you know what? The YouTube stream wasn't showing the chat. God damn it. <laughs> Sorry about that. I don't know why. Yeah, there is a, a whole lot of. Ah, God damn it. I don't know what the hell happened that. I, on my phone, the chat is not showing. You know, it's funny because I thought that you guys weren't responding. <laughs> they were just watching me suffer. <laughs> God damn it. You know what? I'm going to refresh the stream on, on my phone because... Yeah, I missed on a, on a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, now I can see the chat. I'm, I'm sorry. I really thought I was getting the silent treatment. And... Uh, yeah, nothing was showing in my chat, god damn it. Yeah, okay, let me actually catch up on the chat because I had no idea what the hell was going on. Eh, uh, Poseto Kevin, see, then we'll link the, the Capcom town. Okay. Okay, I'm reading the chat. Sorry, I haven't continued the game. The sled in the middle of the tower. Jump on it and then ride it and then jump. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to practice it. Because, I mean, I wasn't able to see this in time. Yeah, I'm sorry. I thought that you guys left me to suffer in silence. <laughs> All right. Yeah, my YouTube app was being just wonky. Okay, let's continue with this. Again, I apologize. I literally didn't see the messages. I had to refresh the stream on my on my phone because I wasn't getting any messages. Any new messages. I can try to do it. I mean, even though the heart isn't there anymore, I can try to do it. But yeah, I wasn't getting any new messages on my phone. Okay, also, uh, welcome Duarte and the Inside Gamer. Apologies, I wasn't ignoring you. I was literally getting no messages. <laughs> Until now.
this is another option. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering why nobody was responding in the chat anymore. <laughs> I should have suspected. I hate those enemies. Okay, I'm gonna do the Iceman <laughs> after I use my charge shot. Never mind, that failed. Well, you know what? I guess that's karma. <laughs> that's what I get. Yeah, I remember that you couldn't do that in Maverick Hunter X anymore. <laughs> Bad box art colors. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna try the Boomer Kuwanger thing just because, you know, I would have listened to you if I had seen the messages. Ah, got the wrong stage. Okay, let's see if I can pull it off. For the sake of completeness.
Okay, so let's see what I have to do. This game taught me to thoroughly explore video games for secrets. Sonic and Knuckles as well. Doomsday Sun was an unexpected surprise. I mean, I also searched for secrets, but you know, like, glitches? I didn't really invoke those. I searched, like, for legitimate secrets. Okay, let's see. The floor? Where the blue support stand is... wait... Blue support stand? What? Okay, let's see... but what is a blue support stand? <laughs> this one is green! The blue thing... oh, okay, okay, okay! And I jump off at the right time. <laughs> Thank you, Zach. Welcome. All right. Let's see. <laughs> okay, I think I get it. I just uh, wasn't fast enough. Okay, let's try again. Okay, so this is how it would have worked. All right. You know what? That's not even a glitch. Okay. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Yeah, I would have done it if I had seen the chat. All right. Now let's see. Mandrill, armadillo. Okay, let's go for armadillo. Okay, it would have been good to know, but you know what, at least I learned something new, and that is still valuable. <laughs> I learned something new today, so that's fine.
Okay, I have four lives, so I can't die the five times for the Hadouken. I didn't forget the sub tank. <laughs> I just waited for the the machine to go through. <laughs> yeah, most of the power ups. I mean, all the power ups in Mega Man X are engraved in my heart. There's no way I can forget them. I tried using lemons, but I was never able to make it work. This is the way I have always been able to beat Armadillo. <laughs> using his own counter. <laughs> que yo sepa, el único, la única arma que le puede quitar la armadura es la de Mandrill. Okay, I can do that in the rematch. <laughs> okay, let's see, so Octopus is next. It's Octopus and Chameleon, the missing ones. Esos son los que faltan.
And now time for Sea Dragon Rodeo. <laughs> Okay, let me see the chat. ¿Versiones de Super Nintendo de Mega Man 1, 2 y 3? ¿O te refieres al Mega Man X 1, 2 y 3? Porque hay diferencia. <risa> ok, I'm gonna use the, the Star Tornado on this one. Damn, that was hilarious. Okay, now time to be sadistic. En ese caso sí te recomiendo este hay versiones mejoradas de las ROMs de Super Nintendo. Okay. Así es Kevin, por ejemplo hay una versión del Mega Man X1 que integra el chip de Super Nintendo SA1 Hace que vaya más rápido y que no tenga ralentizaciones De resto es el Mega Man X puro, nada más va mejor Igual hay ROM hacks que mejoran la velocidad del X2, del X3 eh, Eso voy a ponerle en mi servidor <ríe> Ahí te paso el acceso Si corre el emulador de Super Nintendo, te van a correr esos juegos. De hecho, esos juegos corren mejor. Y la verdad, casi cualquier computadora ahorita corre emuladores de Super Nintendo. Entonces, no creas que pide mucho. <risa> you know, this in Korea, I'm gonna use weaknesses when I do the Maverick rematches. Otherwise. I'm just beating them with the X-Buster. Eh, no te preocupes, Kevin. En el servidor te puedo orientar sobre la emulación, así que no te preocupes. surprised that the robot actually has a weakness aside. I thought that it didn't have any. 
No te preocupes, Kevin. Yo tengo todo eso. Yo te puedo dar el acceso a todo eso que hace falta. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't sure if I should use charge or uncharged. Eh, Kevin, la verdad, la colección de, de Mega Man X no trae tantas mejoras como parece. Así que es la mejor forma legal, sí, pero no es la mejor forma absoluta que existe para disfrutar esos juegos. Okay, I wasn't aware. <laughs> I always thought him in the traditional way. <laughs> Así es, Kevin. De hecho, tengo todos los logros en la Legacy Collection 1. Me faltan en la 2. <laughs>
I have no idea. I noticed that, you know, up to X4, all, all armors were white with something. But I thought, you know, it was more like light being... I mean, white being a representation of light, so Dr. Light or white because justice. You know, as in opposition to darkness. <laughs> Evil. I didn't really think about any references to anime. <laughs> Okay, I can raise the volume, don't worry, there we go. Okay, let's go get the Hadouken. Goodbye, cruel world. <laughs> La lista de las habilidades de los inconformistas. <laughs> ok. <laughs> si te refieres a Mega Man X, me la sé de memoria. Así que no te preocupes. Prácticamente todo lo de Mega Man X está grabado en mi corazón. <laughs> Desde que estaba yo chico. Las habilidades de los Mavericks, la ubicación de las cápsulas, prácticamente todo, me lo sé de memoria. <ríe> al derecho y al revés. <ríe> Y 
Yeah, I think that in my Hunter X it was the the Nana wannabe. <laughs> Doctor Fight Origins. <laughs> okay, gracias Kevin. <laughs> Time to go after Sigma. <laughs> yeah, I also find it a little strange, but you know, endearing. According to some people, this is like the best capture the flag map. <laughs> to me, this is just like my least favorite platforming section in Mega Man X. You know, I can kind of skip the cutscene, but the cutscene is so good that, eh, let's have it. <laughs> mm. 
Eh, sí, puedo ver la lista, no te preocupes. Ok, I'm gonna pin the list. <laughs> ok, there we go. Top 10 muertes más tristes del anime. Kevin, que yo sepa, Vile ni siquiera estaba infectado, sino que era un Maverick por glitch. Porque había un defecto en sus circuitos. Básicamente porque el Dr. Kane hizo a los Reploids con las patas. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Ron Cat. Vile was a glitch maverick. As far as I know. I'm not used to fighting by you. <laughs> okay. I mean, my understanding is that Vile became a maverick because of defects in his circuitry. Because again, Dr. Kane had no idea what the hell he was doing when building Reploids. was a virus to see Korea. I think that he, he was just a, ref a defective reploid. And now this became personal.
Vile and Roaming Shield? Okay, I'm sorry, I saw too late about using Rolling Shield with Vile. <laughs> I can only think of like, of the joke, they see me rolling, they hate it. That a friend of mine wrote a fanfiction about an origin for Vile. It was pretty good. It was in Spanish. But it was pretty good. In Maverick Hunter X, Vile was also the one who saw himself as the hero who was gonna change the world. Yeah, I know. Suffice to say, this is my least favorite boss in this game. Ah, uh, 
sí, lo de que Zero es creación de Wily se sabe desde el X2. <risa> ok, let me go refill my my tanks here. <risa> And then we'll continue. Ok, vamos a Exactly full. <laughs> That was perfect. Also, if that question was to me, round cat, yes, I saw the the ash event. Uh, sorry, the the ash and gray mods. <laughs>
<risa> Mejor le lancé la onda vital a todo gas. <risa> Okay, no more Hadouken. <laughs> He sure felt the sting. <laughs> Also, yeah, oh god, freaking penguin TST they had okay. Okay, let me check. I don't remember rank the bank there's weakness. Because I only ever beat him with the buster. <laughs> so I never had to learn what was the weakness.
Yeah, but it's okay, you know, the X-Buster has always worked. <laughs> Good old X-Buster. Remember, I am a Buster Boy at heart. <laughs> in X Dive and Mega Man X Games. Okay, let's try this, the stun lock for armor armadillo. And just for that little bit of extra humiliation, let's let him die naked. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know I could fully stun lock Armadillo. <laughs> I was aware that you could try to pin him with the lemons, but I was never able to make it work. <laughs> It's time to spark the mandrill.
I guess now it's time to launch the octopus. <laughs> Rebanadito <risa> Y listo el plato <risa> Once again Mutilation time He's gonna die as he lives. As a pig. <laughs> Ok, no me sabía que el boomerang era la debilidad de este. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I really didn't remember the, the weaknesses for this because I only used the buster.
Okay, Sigma time. Time to face Papu Sigma. <laughs> Yeah, I know that the dog was weak to shotgun eyes. Okay, now let's rock and roll. Well, there we go. <laughs> this is me rolling. You hate it. Dogs don't like being don't like being called. Tell that to Siberian huskies and Alaskan malamutes.
Yeah. The armor came in clutch. <laughs> Okay, that is true. The war has ended for now and peace has been restored. But those who sacrifice themselves for victory will never return. Exhausted, X gazes at the destruction he helped cause and wonders why he chose to fight. Was there another way? Standing on the cliff, the answer seemed to escape him. He only knows that he'll fight the Mavericks again before he finds his answer. How long will he keep on fighting? How long will his pain last? Maybe only the ex-buster of his hand knows for sure. Also, yeah, I know Ramcat. But you know, historically, I think that dogs largely evolved from wolves that lived in cold places. In comparison, cats evolved from desert cats, which kind of explains why they mostly don't like water. They are not used to it. So I would say that in general, dogs should have more tolerance for the cold than cats. In broad terms. at least X was determined to fight for a better world and then X7 came along and murdered his character <laughs> and then X7 came along <laughs> I have to open X dive because I need to collect my energy. So excuse the slowdown. Wait. Yeah, the slowdown is because I'm opening the Android emulator, so sorry about that. I just need to collect my energy as soon as possible. Well, you can see that my computer can't cope with both uh, the Android emulator and Mega Man X. Damn, this doesn't look good. In Japanese, you can pron you pronounce Doctor Light as Doctor, well, Doctor Raito, so you know that would be Doctor Right. By the way, I said it before, but I will say it again. I love when old games credit you as the player. <laughs> I think that's one of the nice things from old times that has been largely lost. I don't know why, but it was a nice touch. Yeah, I know, there is no L in Japanese. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah, X Dive was never canon. You know, the thing is that X Dive is a meta game because it it's aware that the others are games. You know, it doesn't treat them like real history. I mean, Mega Man's history is real in Mega Man X, and Mega Man X's history is real in Mega Man Zero. But in X Dive, all of those are treated as video games. So that was always my gripe with X Dive. It makes sense in a way, but. They didn't use the full potential of that idea. If they wanted to go that route. That route. Wait, what? The hell, Rocket? This is literally the first time in my life I've heard of this. What? Are you kidding me? That, of all the possible reasons, it's that one? God freaking hell. You have won a temporary victory, X. What you destroyed was only a temporary body. My spirit remains intact. In time, I will find other bodies strong enough to do my bidding. And I will return. I shall see you soon, X. Very soon. Insert obligatory evil laugh. <laughs> okay, but with that, you know, we bring this officially to an end. And you know what? The performance on Opera GX was better. So, yeah, it was worth it doing it, in the, doing it again. I don't know why Firefox is so clunky, but <laughs> yeah, Sigma's not gonna give up easily. All right. Okay, guys, now just give me one moment. I'm just quickly gonna collect uh, collect my energy next dive. Yeah, I think I can do it. You know, I didn't want to touch Battle Network with a 10-foot stick, but I guess I will have to. <laughs> I mean, at least it's a platformer, so I guess uh, the pain is going to be lessened. Okay, I'm just collecting myself in exact. <laughs> All right, mission accomplished. Uh, Kevin, X Dive no es canon, es un juego meta. Mira, te lo voy a poner muy fácil. Los juegos de Mega Man manejan como que su historia es real o sea dentro del mundo de Mega Man lo que sucede es real dentro de la historia de Mega Man X la historia de Mega Man es real y la historia de Mega Man Zero también lo que pasó en X y en la clásica es real pero en Mega Man X Dive es meta porque te tratan todos los demás como videojuegos o sea como que X Dive está en el mundo real y tacatín tacatán eh, el deep log, los juegos, tus recuerdos. Eso es lo que a muchos no les gustó y para mí es como 50-50 porque había potencial para desarrollar eso, pero hubiera preferido que fuera algo tipo un crossover épico y no de que ah, todos son juegos. Sí.
It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun holding a bad game. I found Super Mario 64. Uh, they used bookstore and bought it for the lulz. Yeah, I guess I get that. Except I don't have the spare money to buy anything for the lulz. I can understand the idea. It's just that in practice I can never execute it <laughs> because of a severe lack of funding. But I get that the principle. El registro profundo. Eh, sí, la traducción al español está rara. Aunque Deep Log, registro profundo. De hecho, sí cuadra. <laughs> el, mundo el mundo digitalizado. <coughs> Digimon. El Digimundo. <laughs> Okay, let's see, DC Korea. I wouldn't touch a bad game with a 39 and a half football. <laughs> well, yes, I get it. ¿Acaso Wild está reiniciando la línea de tiempo de la serie? Uh, see you next time, Five Hyper, and thank you for sticking around. Wild is probably Surge's next too. <laughs> okay, Kevin. Según lo que yo entiendo, Wiley trató de viajar al pasado varias veces para vencer a Mega Man y aún así le falló. Por eso tenemos los juegos de Game Boy, los de Mega Man 1 al 5 Game Boy, que son diferentes a los juegos de Mega Man 1 y 5 de Nintendo. Entonces, no creo que intencionalmente haya querido reiniciar la línea temporal, pero sí trató de hacer trampa, viajar en el tiempo y recolectar robots del pasado o del futuro para tratar de ganarle a Mega Man y ni así pudo <risa> eso es lo peor así como en X-Dive cuando sacan hacks y aún así pierden ni haciendo trampa el pinche Dr. Wiley <risa> ni así pudo entonces no creo que intencionalmente haya querido reiniciar la línea del tiempo sino que trató de usar los viajes en el tiempo como como código de trampas y ni así le pudo ganar a Mega Man Sí, básicamente. Okay, guys. Well, that's gonna be the end of the stream. You know, I actually enjoyed this. I, I, I mean, there's no way I'm not gonna enjoy playing the, the classic Mega Man X game. So, yeah. And also, you know, a little promoting. You know, you can see that. Uh, uh, and let me show the link. Okay, uh, wait, uh, I think I messed up. Okay, I mean, I, I type it on Google, but you see, it's captown.capcom.com slash es. Well, es is because my computer is in Spanish. Retro, uh, I forgot the, the, the name of this, under underscore games slash six slash en or you know just type it on google and it's gonna be the first link so you know it's available it's for free and it's a nice thing that capcom did and it has controller support so there is literally nothing to complain about <laughs> El ending de X-Dive y confirma que lo estaba haciendo de nuevo. <ríe> no tengo pruebas, pero tampoco dudas. <ríe> sí, lo entiendo. Wiley, de alguna manera, digamos que es el, el frijol que siempre está en el ajo. <ríe> Algo así. Hay una frase así que, que se dice por acá. Sí, Wiley siempre va a estar metido de algún modo. Okay, guys. Well, again, thank you so much. I enjoyed this. You know, it was a nice Friday night thing. Okay, so I think that on Monday, I'm gonna be doing the game that Roundcat requested. That's gonna be Mega Man Battle Network for Wonder Swan. It's gonna be my first experience with Battle Network. So there is that. You know, I'm gonna be resting on Tuesday. On Wednesday, I guess I'm gonna be doing more Roblox, but yeah, we can't do the, the merchant ship. You know what? I'm gonna consider recording it and uploading as a video. 
because I, I'm not gonna be able to get it on stream. And uh, you know, on Thursday I'm gonna be resting. On Friday, I guess you know I have to finish Donkey Kong Country. I can't keep postponing it. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, this is Korea exactly. Sí, la verdad es que el X1 es probablemente el mejor juego de toda la saga. Y lo que estaba diciendo al principio del stream es impresionante que el primer juego sea el mejor, pero también es triste. <risa> Porque quiere decir que ninguno lo pudo superar. Eso es una tragedia de, en cierto modo. Eh, así es, Kevin. Los sábados y domingos son de Mega Man XOD. Así que sí, el Community Edition. El Vanilla, por sus problemas con el online, no lo estoy tocando mucho, aunque veo que hay gente que lo quiere. Voy a seguir evaluando la situación y ver si vale la pena, pero por lo pronto va a ser el Community Edition. Ah, tú también quieres que sea el Vanilla. Ok, creo que en este caso puedo alternar. Podría tener el Vanilla el domingo y el sí los sábados. Porque sí, hay que apoyar el Community Edition, es el futuro. El Vanilla tiene sus cosas, tiene su estabilidad, pero es un código espagueti infernal sostenido con banditas, o sea, con curitas y fuerza de voluntad. Así que prácticamente por la gracia del Dr. Light es que se sostiene el código de esa porquería. Good night, dice Corea. Ok, en ese caso... Sí, creo que eso voy a hacer. Creo que el sábado va a ser el CE y el domingo va a ser el Vanilla. Y así, pues, todos contentos. <ríe> yes, this is a real sleepy mambo. Alright, guys. <ríe> ok, Kevin. Sí, ya sabes. Cualquier cosa me echas un ping y te contestaré lo más rápido que pueda. Si estoy ocupado, a lo mejor tarda, pero no se me va a olvidar. Apenas pueda, te contestaré. Okay guys, uh, thank you so much for sticking around, that's it for tonight, so you know, whatever your time zone is, have a good one, and hopefully see you tomorrow on the Mega Man Exodus stream, until the next time.